The stories Jonathan Prather is telling, a peanut factory with incessant roach problems and more. A rat was dry roasted in the peanuts. Are sensational to hear and further disturbing news for his former employer, the Peanut Corporation of America, or PCA, now at the center of a salmonella outbreak and a federal criminal investigation. On the heels of this Blakely, Georgia plant being shut down, there is word another PCA plant is getting attention. A Texas facility, which was unlicensed and went uninspected since it opened four years ago. PCA, headquartered in this home in Lynchburg, Virginia, is a 33-year-old family business run by Stuart Parnell. Incredibly, Parnell sits on the U.S. Department of Agriculture's Peanut Standards Board. Roaches get up in that dry roast and get, because someone they'll blend in with the peanuts, you'll never know they're there. Most of Parnell's Georgia employees were let go last month, as the full scope of a salmonella outbreak became clear. Investigators believe tainted products from PCA sickened more than 500 and may have killed eight products they believe the company knew were unsafe. Meanwhile, product recalls continue mounting. More today, nearly 900 in all, ranging from ice cream to trail mix. And while Prather is the only one who's spoken on camera about unsafe conditions, his eyewitness accounts of roaches, a leaky roof, and mold are backed up by inspection reports. But experts say it's not just more inspections that are needed, it's punishments too. We have to get the expectation out to the private sector that when these kinds of things happen, it may not only cost them financially, but also with prison time. Because if not, they say it's not a question of if the next outbreak happens, but when. Jeff Glor, CBS News, Blakely, Georgia.